The new Slopes application in iConstruct allows you to quickly create reference surfaces based upon elevation and grade, which can then be used to set up profile boards to guide excavation, and also to perform regular comparisons between actual position and design. These reference surfaces can be defined by specifying the grade of the profile you need to work at and how it is positioned relative to the point and line data in your working area. They can be connected to arcs, lines or simply single points and offset from this data both horizontally and vertically. In this example use case, assume that a banking must be constructed beyond this road line at a grade of 2 to 3, horizontal to vertical. The beginning of the banking must be offset from this road line by 1 meter. The vertical height of the banking will be 5 meters. A profile can quickly be created on this basis by tapping the line, defining the required slope inclination, and how it is offset from the reference line. The orange area represents the specified slope. Define the maximum height in the toolbox. Options are available to control the orientation of the reference surface relative to the initial design element. Flip axis, down slope and up slope are all available. Press accept to confirm settings for the slope. To redefine the slope characteristics at any time, select Edit Slope from the toolbox. Once measurements are initiated, in this example using a total station, the position of the prism is indicated on screen, in real time, along with the intersection point to the reference surface, perpendicular to the initial reference at the current measured height. As well as the prism position being displayed, Key measurement data is displayed in the info panel, including the cut or fill value, that is the vertical distance between the current position and the design surface. This value is that horizontal distance between the current position and the reference surface, perpendicular to the initial reference element. As well as being able to view data in plan mode, there is a cross-section view, which can be turned on and off using this button. The cross-section that is viewed is defined by the current position of the prism perpendicular to the selected reference line. The current position can be viewed relative to the reference surface, which begins here and ends here. This point represents the initially selected line, and this is the offset to that design element, also displayed here in the info panel. As the pole moves around the surface, the colour of the point changes, depending on being above or below the created reference surface. In the 7-inch version of iConstruct, it is possible to split the screen to display two views at once. This can be utilised in the Slopes application to display the plan view and cross-section view simultaneously. As points are stored on the surface, their colour indicates whether they are above or below the reference surface quickly giving an overview of the current situation. It is possible to configure the cut or fill value to be displayed next to the point using the Viewing Options tool. Tap another data set and a profile is immediately created, ready to be checked in the same manner, with the same grade and offset applied. So the Slopes application is a convenient, fast and effective way to accurately monitor the construction of profiles in the field without the need to spend any undue time in the office creating data. The data you need can be created very quickly while still in the field.